do you want an unlimited automations without paying monthly? I'll show you how to self-host and at end using a VPS. Fast, easy, and budget-friendly. And at end or no domination is a free open source automation tool, no coding needed, quick to set up, and super flexible. Why I choose to self-host and at end instead of using its cloud? While Anet and Cloud is easy to start with, it can get expensive really fast if you need higher usage, multiple workflows, or unlimited executions. By self-hosting, I get full control over my automation platform, unlimited workflows and executions, plus no monthly fees, just the cost of the BPS server. For my server, I choose Hetzner because it's one of the most affordable, fast, reliable, and they have multiple server locations to choose from. So if you want to save money, build unlimited automations, and learn something cool, self-hosting is the way to go. First, log in or sign up at Hetzner.com. Go to the project section and create a new project. Select your server location. Here, I am choosing EU Central for low latency and affordable costs, but you can pick up one that closest to you. For the image, just select Ubuntu 24.04. If you don't have an SSH key yet, you need to generate one from your terminal. Open your terminal and type the following. Hit enter and it will generate a new key pair. You can leave the passphrase empty or add one for extra security. Paste this in the SSH key field on Hetzner when setting up your BBS. And please don't forget to set up your Hetzner firewall to allow traffic on the following ports. Port 22 for SSH, port 80 for HTTP, port 443 for HTTPS. Without this, your server won't be accessible. Once your VPS is created, connect to it via terminal using this. Update your server packages. Then install Docker. Install Docker Compose. Start the Docker. And enable it to auto start. Create a folder for your project. Go to that folder. Then create your Docker Compose file. Paste this configuration. Make sure to update the domain username and password to your details. Save Ctrl X then press Y to Now let's connect your domain. I'm using GoDaddy for my domain and Cloudflare for the DNS management. If you're using a Cloudflare for DNS management, make sure to create an A record for your domain. Example, rdomain.com pointing to your BPS IP. And proxy status is DNS only. Copy the Cloudflare's name servers and update them in your GoDaddy domain settings. Install the Nginx using this. And then install CertBot. Secure your site using this and it will automatically configure HTTPS. Create a new Nginx configuration. And then save the file using Ctrl X and then Y to confirm. Activate it using this. Then test the configuration. 
Restart Nginx. Visit to your domain and you should now see the NFN setup screen. Log in using the credentials you set in your Docker Compose file. Congratulations! You now have paid features for free forever! You can use all advanced features with unlimited executions and you have just saved yourself hundreds of dollars per year. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and leave your questions in the comments to help you out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial.